We're in Southampton today. Quantum of the Seas has just arrived. A brand new ship, our most exciting newest ship that we've ever launched. And she's here sailing out of Southampton for her maiden voyage. The ship has arrived, it is magnificent. And uh, I'm feeling great because the crew is so excited to get a chance to show this off. We've never before tried to do so much new things, not only in terms of the architecture of the ship, the activities on board, but also the technology. I've been on this ship for 24 hours, but I've been involved in learning about the technology um, as a technology ambassador for this ship for the last few months. And I'm just floored by it. We're calling it the smart ship. So for example, it's got more bandwidth than any other cruise ship put together in the whole world. You can go from check-in onto the ship in 10 minutes and there are amazing features on board. So this is truly changing the face, not just of cruising, but in fact of the whole holiday market. Well, personally, I think the thing everybody's talking about is the North Star, which is here, takes everybody up. You can be like being on the top of a 30-story building, looking out at everything over the side of the vessel. If you took a football pitch and stood it on its end, that's how high up you are. And you can imagine any port in the world, some of the great cities that the ship will be going to, and you can just go that high up and just get a panoramic view when you're in port. I, I think that's something that just can't, can't be matched anywhere. Well, my favourite feature is Cplex. Cplex is an entertainment space that's designed to be flexible, to allow you to go to circus school one day. Uh, the next day you can be a floating DJ above the 80s roller disco. And then after that you can go and get yourself a hot dog. And we also have the ability to go in bumper cars. For me, we called by iFly, which is a skydiving machine. The reason I find this amazing is who else would have thought of putting a skydiving machine on a ship that sails in the middle of the ocean? Flow rider, surfing on board the ship. It doesn't get more futuristic than this. 270, an incredible uh, vistarama, in fact, that's what it's called, these, the screens. So you, you walk in and it's ceiling to floor glass. Then the uh, screens come down and the whole thing is made into a 12K high resolution cinema screen. And they interact with a cast of dancers and it is magical, it's incredible. Everybody is excited about the Bionic Bar. You know, it's two robots mixing drinks. It's really turned out to be a great success. You have a band around your wrist where you can order your drink through, and then the robots will create whatever drink that you want. And everyone who's seen it so far has just been highly amused and entertained by it. I mean, all of these experiences have just exceeded my expectations, and they are expectations that have been right up here from day one. It doesn't get more insane or more cool than that. Wow just not what you expect on a cruise ship and that really sums up what this is it's not what you expect from a cruise ship. Well Royal Caribbean has been at the forefront of innovation since it launched over 40 years ago and it's always it's about anticipating what the customer wants. Quantum distills all of our best learning over those 40 years into a brand new ship. It's really important in terms of attracting new clients people who, who think cruising isn't for them but you see this and you can't believe that for us this is a game changer. To see it here to see that this really is the latest in cutting edge technology and holiday experiences and that we can show it to the world, we're so excited to really be able to show off the ship.